Hello everyone, once again it's Ben from AtomicEmporium.com and today I have an interesting little uh, gadget I built. It's got a 9 volt battery going to some little pairs of transistors going to a little ion chamber all nicely mounted inside this can with an LED on the back. So, you probably can't see very well but it's glowing very dimly right now. I can calibrate it so it glows dimly or not at all with a little uh, variable resistor in here. I'll make it uh, show you so I can do that. Turn it up and it just glows all the time. Turn it down to right about before it glows and that's your best sensitivity. So glowing dimly. And um, it's an open air chamber. So in theory you could just breathe moisture in there but it doesn't seem to be that sensitive. I'm not sure uh, how or why I can make it that sensitive, but I'll probably adapt it later for something totally different. But this is a little, uh, about one microcurie americium source from an old smoke detector. I'll put this in the chamber. Here goes the LED. Flickering from the radiation. And I can only read this when it's like almost right up next to the chamber, so it's not very useful. I meant to make one that could, um, say, you could take it around to two flea markets and find uranium plates. But this one's only sensitive to very high alpha active things like americium. I could take something like an old radium watch, and it does pretty much nothing. Yeah, absolutely nothing with the and maybe a microcurry of radium. But the Amaris camera seems to work pretty well, it gives me hope. Cute little device. Supposedly it'll run forever with the battery on, just because the battery is using almost no current now, because the ion chamber is just open. But regardless, we have a little on off switch built in here. Not very well mounted or anything, just a fun uh, toy to mess with. The circuit board was a piece of PC board that I routed a few notches in. You can see one there just to uh, help with the parts. All soldering done by me. My dad helped me with the design because he's a wizard at radio stuff and circuit boards. So yeah, fun little toy but not actually that useful. <laughs> Bye.